We're on your side following up on a story we first brought you over the weekend. A Saturday morning fishing trip for a mom and son quickly caused concern as they discovered dozens and dozens of dead fish up and down the riverbank on the Flint River. That's right. So a fish kill was discovered on the riverbank right off Homer Nance Road. It also sits directly behind Mount Carmel Elementary School and a county landfill. WAFF 48 Claudia Petmanhorst joins us live from the Flint River. Claudia, the fish are now gone. But there are still unanswered questions here. That's right, Margo. On Saturday, dozens of dead fish were discovered up and down the Flint Riverbank, which is about a mile down this nature path you see right here behind me. Now, I revisited the area today, and I didn't discover any dead fish. There was also no smell that our Daquan Lee reported on over the weekend. Now, with no dead fish and no smell, many questions remain unanswered, like what caused all the fish to die? Founder of Tennessee Riverkeeper David Whiteside says with a landfill, a sewage treatment plant and an agriculture site nearby, pollutants could have gotten into the water and caused the fish kill. But he says he can't say for sure what caused the numerous fish to die. Whiteside says it's ultimately up to state departments like the Alabama Department of Environmental Management to investigate. These are kind of like a, a fish murder investigation where the first 48 hours of figuring out what's going on are super important. And now that we are beyond that, um, it, it, it's often convenient for the state to say, oh, well, it was the weekend. We didn't have time to investigate. And now there's nothing to see there now. Now, leaders with ADEM tell me that they had not been notified of any ongoing fish kill, but based off my media request, they're going to investigate the area. Reporting live in Huntsville, Claudia Peppenhorst, 48, on your side.